is Raj Arya and we have a series of exclusive web episodes specially for you covering some of the most happening events, raid carpet functions as well as fashion shows around Klang Valley. Well tonight as you can see I am in Lunaba where we're going to cover the farewell party of the most happening beatboxing runway strutting managing director none other than Soren Raf the managing director of Carlsberg Malaysia now you want to know what's in store tonight well please don't go away because it's a night you will never forget oh, sometimes I get a good feeling yeah Soren, you've been here for three and a half years. What was the thing you loved the most about Malaysia? No, I love many things about Malaysia. If I have to pick thing, uh, one thing it has to be the people of Malaysia. From the day I landed here, it was just an amazingly warm feeling about feeling welcome in this country. And then it's sort of supplemented by the weather, the food, the cold beer, the friendliness of people, the, the pace of life we have in Malaysia. It's just one of the most lovable countries you can imagine to live in. So girls, how are you finding the party thus far? Well, it's rocking. We love the cocktails, we love the drinks, and of course all the entertainment and the singing. So everything's good, really good. We're having lots of fun. It's only Soren who can bring everybody from all sorts of industries here to party like this. So you know what? Every single time a causal party is always going to be rocking. We're going to wait for him to start rapping and beatboxing soon. He has to yes, beatbox. It has to he, he is probably the only MD we know that beatboxes. How cool is that? Rapping, runway model, uh, beatboxer. Can you just tell us a bit more about that? No, I think uh, one thing I found in Malaysia is the ability to connect with all people from all uh, layers of society is extremely important here. And I think the, the most important thing that, uh, that you can add coming as a foreigner here is to connect with people, come out there, represent what your, what your brand is about. And uh, if the entertainment, uh, entertainment value is good in Malaysia, it's acceptable. So you don't have to worry too much about embarrassing yourself. If you reach out, if you enjoy what you do, if you have some vague degree of talent of what you do, it works. I know this as well, you have a bit of the Malaysian slang which you picked up over the last three and a half years. Ayya, what are you talking about la? Sorry for party rocking. I'm here with Henrik Anderson, the incoming Managing Director of Carlsberg Malaysia. Welcome to Malaysia. Thank you very much. I understand that this is not your first time in Malaysia. That's true, I was uh, here for a short period of time in the, uh, in the mid 90s in fact. And where would you like to see Carlsberg Malaysia perhaps three years down the road? Well, I think the most important thing for us is uh, to continue to bring enjoyment and fun to our consumers. Uh, we've got a great portfolio of brands in Malaysia. The Casper brand is the most loved beer brand in Malaysia. So I see it as my, as my task to continue to uh, build the brands we have in our company. And I'm quite sure that uh, you know we will continue to enjoy the the support of the Malaysian consumers. Now I see you have a very interesting drink in your hand. Can you tell us a bit more about it? Orange slammer. I took uh, one sip and that's it. Yeah, it went down all the way until here until you interrupted. Yeah. <laughs> There's not enough time in this life to drink bad beer. Soren brings a magic to the room. You know, he's kind of guy. You know, he's really big. You know, when he comes around, he brings a magic by by really being friendly to everyone and be happiness for everyone and. Uh, Full of joy, full of happiness. Eh? I will fill the swimming pool with Carlsberg beer and swim in it, drink in it, wash in it, and probably pee in it. I assume naked. Of course, because beer and textiles don't go together. But beer and skin is wonderful. You know, look at my face. I wash my face with beer, Carlsberg, every morning. Now, was that a party or what? Well, we hope you enjoyed the first of a number of series which you're going to have here on this channel. Soren, we would like to say a fond farewell to you and we wish you all the best in your exploits in China and Hong Kong. You know, if I could really go on the air worldwide, you know what I'll do? 
，一个世界上又千剂、五剂、水剂又有含湿鬼呀！ Yeah!